Hello, my name is Andy Tattersall. I'm an information specialist based at the School of Health and Related Research at the University of Sheffield. This is a series of very short videos, uh, primarily for medical and health students to help them get more out of uh, their mobile devices uh, and show them the many apps that they can use as part of their study and as a professional. Uh, this next one that I'm going to show you is one that's called Prognosis. Prognosis is, is recommended by the Royal College of Surgeons. It's available on iOS and it's also available uh, on Android via Google, um, Google Play. So I'm going to drill in now and show you how to use this app. So this again is another one which has been recommended by the Royal College of Surgeons. Uh, in the review, they they kind of have it down as a, a, a fun to use in your spare time. It's a very kind of interactive one for choosing diagnostic tests and for management options uh, with feedback. So it gives you kind of enough to keep you interested. Uh, one of the cons of when it was actually reviewed was that there was only 68 cases at the time. So, but more have probably been added since this review was done. So the way it works is, is you can go in and... Um, kind of select different cases so if I click here on cases it will bring out various kind of cases that you may be presented with uh, working as a medical um, professional so we'll start with uh, one here uh, we'll scroll down to burning okay so I'll tap on this one that's called burning so it'll download this and it'll say play case to, to reveal the disease so in here we get the um, we get the patient presented to us, a 55 year old woman um, and uh, she's got uh, uh, epigastric pain and intermittent heartburn and uh, regurgitation for the last two years. So we, we, we get all the information as to what this patient has presented as she's come in. So then we do our investigation. So we choose what relevant investigations we should should do. So I'm just going to randomly, obviously you don't need to follow, follow me, you'll be more of an expert in this than I am, but I will just do uh, an endoscopy and um, I've now been given some information here regarding to what I've chosen so I will close that and I will also perform the uh, diagnostic uh, well I can't even say the word so the one at the bottom I will click that okay and I've just been told that it's probably not indicated right now so we'll close that down I'll go into the manage function so this gives me an option to manage these particular um, uh, options here so we'll go for antacids I'll select yes for that I'll leave the rest as no and then do finish and it'll say are you really finished which is probably an indication that I failed so I'll say yes I finished and I've been told that I've done poorly so I can go down here with the analysis it will show me how I've done in terms of my results so I got the repeat endoscopy was a good idea uh, but uh, I should have done the fasting serum gastrin and I should have done uh, the third choice. I shouldn't have done the uh, laroscopy. And um, I was I was uh, right on two in terms of the management, but wrong on two. So if I click on the explanation, it will then give me information as to why I should have made the decisions as I did. And then there's some comments from people, uh, fellow students that have obviously been doing this. They're, they're giving comments as to just generally about the app. And then I get the option to try again. So um, so there are plenty of options in there and plenty to try. If I go back to all cases, you can see that there are lots and lots for you to try. So it is, you know, just something perhaps to kind of prop up your uh, professional knowledge and uh, maybe to discuss with, with fellow students and uh, clinicians. So one to have a look at. Uh, so it's called Prognosis. It's available on iPhone, uh, iPad and Android and it is totally free. 